Hello, people from YouTube. I am, um, I am making a short-ish video to show you how I animate. So, if you've followed my recent path over the years, you'll know that I created a channel a while ago that kinda went dead because I haven't uploaded anything yet, called HHH Animations. So I'm just making a video to show you how I animate and that I am going to get stuff on there very soon. So first I usually create a title but sometimes I just jump right in. I usually have a small window of space um, that I just have a title with. So like um, how I, what the I did not know that carried over. Excuse me for a second. Um, this is very awkward. Um, kind of forgot about that, and I didn't know that it did it on all, not just Google Docs. Um, I tried to make my own code language, didn't work out so well. Well, it did, but you have to press space between every letter. It's pretty annoying, and sometimes you forget that um, it reminds you. Ay, ay, ay. Anyways, I'll probably cut uh, after right here out, so you'll just see. To after I do this. Sorry if I'm talking quietly. It's not because I'm actually talking quietly. It's because I'm using built-in Windows 10 uh, recording software. So, yeah. So I'm not sure if I cut that out or not as the f at the time of recording. I probably did, but if I didn't, well, hooray, you get to see my code language. But um, how I animate. Good. So um, first what I do is I usually create this title page. And then I create a new blank page. And I'm using Google Slides, a free online thing that's usually Google's version of PowerPoint, but I sometimes use it to animate. So, yeah. So first, I'll, um, I'll do whatever I want to start with. Say I'll just have a stick man. Um, no, that's... Um... Thickness. Four... Eight. Uh, should I... No, I'll just leave it basic. Uh... Line... ones at that eight pixels black eight pixels it, it's a very tedious process but uh, if you do it just right it comes out with a good animation um, Now 
Now here's a little trick. So uh, I'm just gonna copy and paste that. And just go ahead and set that like that. Uh, and you'll adjust it just just to make it look good. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, duplicate slide. Now, I have this certain style of animation. Uh, where I kind of just do it like this. Uh. Ah, dang it. Um, copy. Ah! Okay, duplicate. Now, when this all comes out, it's actually going really fast. So the nice thing with Google Slides is if there's a bit where they stay still for a long time, you can just stop holding down the forward button and, um, and just have it sit there for a minute. But, um... That's kind of hard to know exactly which frame that is, so sometimes there's just things you can do to remind you, but for me it's just like, no, I just want to be able to hold forward. Anyway, so what I'm doing right now is I'm just duplicating the slide, then making that a bit longer, and I'm almost done. Um, now if I want the stickman to move, I'd be animating him alongside that, but I can just go back and change him in his uh, frame. So, like, um, let's make it to So yeah, uh, duplicate. I I wish there was a key that could duplicate that or a key combination you could press to duplicate. But there we go. Let's just go ahead and uh, create a new blank one. Now this is uh this is something else I do. Um, I go ahead and insert word art. And I do whatever I want to say, like, um, thin. Now, obviously, I'm going to use some sort of ridiculous font, like Calligraffiti. Yeah. Then I'm just going to set what I want to use for that. Um, like, um... And the background black. Then go ahead and center it. And now I just create a really big square. I'm going to use like that. It's going to cover up Finn. Um, set that to black. Go ahead and select that to transparent. So like, um, yeah, like that. Can't see it, at, at least when you're playing the frames, but, uh, duplicate. Duplicate. And I'm using the arrow keys to go down and left one.
and there. So let's go ahead and 